The round of 16 is now down to the final four in the women's bracket at the 97th Birchmont. Today's semifinals included a rematch from last year's final and a battle between two collegiate teammates. Women teed off this morning at 9-10. Skip to hole seven, Abby Kelm. Off the green, nice chip, rolls it right up close to the hole. She would make that for par to win the hole. To the back nine, facing off against UND teammate Morgan Heddletwit. Hole 11 for Birdie, she drains it to win her third hole in a row. To hole 14, Heddletwit on the downhill par three. It's a nice shot, I'm gonna lose it a little bit in the clouds, but trust me, when it comes down, it's gonna end up very close to the flag. Runs right in front of the hole. Head of twit will move out of the way. You'll see just how close that is, but you gotta pay it off, you gotta make the putt. She does four up with four to play. She has the 15th, the teammates embrace. Head of twilt wins four and three. Other matchup, Emily Israelson and Maddie Herzog. Hole six, Herzog two up. Just sneaks that in for par. Herzog was one up going to the back nine. Israelson for par on 12. Herzog bogeys, Israelson now three up. To 16, Israelson for birdie up the hill. Perfect pace, perfect line, sneaks it in. So Herzog needs this to extend the match. No problem for Maddie, she does. They go to 17. Israelson on the fairway, just like she was all day. Gets it, just a little bounce off the hill. If she makes this birdie putt, she wins. Perfect pace to this one, just misread it a little bit, but that was close enough. Herzog concedes the match. Israelson wins two to one, advances to her fourth straight championship match. So Israelson and Heddletwit tomorrow at 1 p.m. for the championship. Men's quarterfinals started at 12.10 this afternoon. Danny Menton on hole five. Hits a nice approach shot, spins it back a little bit closer to the flag. He would miss the birdie putt and he has the hole. He's playing against this guy, Andrew Israelson on hole seven. A good look for birdie. Man, did he make a lot of those today. He wins over Mitten five and four. Nick Schaefer on hole 10, down two in the match. Hits a nice chip from just above the bunker. Gets it close to the hole. He's got a chance to win the hole, but he just pushes it right. And when you're playing against a guy like Nate Adams, you gotta convert those, especially when he does stuff like this on 11. Perfect speed, perfect line, rolls it in. Adams advances with a five and four win. They're playing alongside Schaefer and Adams was Jim Foss from just off the green on hole 12. Foss with another nice touch, the Breezy Point native. Knocks it in close, but that was for bogey and his opponent, Jake Scarperud. This is his par putt, he'd make it, but Foss wins the match two and one. Match of the day in the men's side, Jay Gregory and Chris Swenson. This is Swenson on 15. Rolls in the birdie putt with Gregory looking on. Now it's Gregory's turn, steps in. No problem for him, sinks the birdie. To 16, Swenson to putt first. Center of the cup for Swenson. Gregory's turn on the opposite side. Man, he just brings that putter back a little bit. Perfect speed, no problem. All square to 17. This is Gregory's birdie putt. Swenson was in trouble off the tee. Just a perfect roll. Cozes it up next to the hole. He'd win 17, 18 in the match, two up. So the semifinals are set in bracket one. Andrew Israelson will take on Jim Foss and Nate Adams will take on Jay Gregory. Both of those matches start at 8.10 in the morning. Lakeland News is member-supported content. Please consider supporting Lakeland News today.